Ho, ho, how do? It's Christmas Day. Well, it's Christmas Day when I'm uploading this. I'm filming this on Christmas Eve. So before I get into my Friday challenge, I'd just like to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and hope today is as good as it can be. We all stay safe and hopefully next Christmas it's a bit more normal. So um, Merry Christmas, everybody. Um, thank you, as always, for your continued support of the channel. It is greatly appreciated. Um, it's Friday Challenge, so you know what, how it works with Friday Challenge. I do anything that is drink-related when it comes to Friday Challenges. I've done dragon soups in the past, and this challenge has been set by my wife. And she's asked me to do Sainsbury's Taste the Difference Mulled Wine. That's 11%. So, um, it's in a green glass bottle. Um, I don't know if that means anything. I'm no wine connoisseur. I'll just get the nose off the bottle. And it just smells like a regular red wine to me. Um, I'm getting a, a hint of spices with it being a mould drink. So, I've warmed it up in the microwave. Um, or the micro wavy as Nigella called it this week before I get onto the drink though I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself I need to show you my jumper so there you go so for the people who are outside of the UK um, Greg's well Greg is my name as most of you know um, but Greg's is the largest bakery in the UK there is it's a massive chain of um, bakeries and they're, uh, they're coming at Christmas you get sausage rolls that come in a little paper bag and this is the bag it's got my name on it so there you go that's me that's about as festive as you get on the channel um oh and there's me uh the Carlisle united stocking three points please santa against bolton on boxing day would not go amiss so um i've warmed it up in the microwave as i said here is my drink in my Bowman's beer reviews mug that was kindly given to me as a present from my brother for my 40th. So thank you again, Dale. We are not doing merch on this channel. I'm not bringing out a range of t-shirts and hoodies and mugs. Nobody will buy them. Nobody wants to see my face plastered over things. So this is a bespoke item. Um, so um, it is deep red. Um, I'll try and bring the camera up into the glass can see in there you go so um yeah um it just looks like red wine to me i'll just get the nose now that it's, it's been warm 50 seconds i gave it i don't know it just tells you to gently warm it and i'm getting the spices i'm getting like cinnamon cloves nutmeg it smells like orange right let's dive in cheers everybody warm sweet like I said I'm getting that orange I'm getting spices um, the, the flavor kind of mellows out very quick but it's very easy to drink I like I said I'm no red wine connoisseur I'm no um, mulled wine connoisseur um, my wife tells me that this is an award-winning mulled wine um, it's nice as far as more wines go for me so if you like more wine i'm gonna recommend it um my red wine drinking pretty much is um, a bargain bottle in the corner shop from on occasions or when i'm at a wedding and sometimes i might have a beer that's been aged in a red wine barrel so that's about me and wine but i don't mind this i wouldn't drink a lot of it my wife has no worries that i'm gonna demolish the bottle when she's not looking so the bottle will stay around so yeah i don't know what you paid for it um it says on the back grapes german and italian grape varieties the style is warm and spicy the taste is citrus fruit and spicy notes serve warm with mince pies and it's got a guide to the body of the wine a b and light and it goes a b c d e and e b and full bodied and this is a c so I 
don't know what that means. Well, it's a medium bodied wine. Um, it didn't taste thin, so there you go. I'll agree with the bottle. So that is Sainsbury's Taste the Difference mulled wine. Like I say, I do do Friday challenges that are non beer related. Keep the challenges coming. Hopefully, we can keep this going into 2021. The channel's going nowhere. Um, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Be reviews to follow tomorrow. On to the next one.